Planet B. Hello. My name is Sequoia. I'm the founder and creator of Silky Socks, and today I'm here to do a review on the Model Model Peruvian Foxy Deep Synthetic Wig. So I ordered this wig from Sam's Beauty Supply. I think it was $27.99 before shipping and handling. I will put the link down in the um, description if you'd like to uh, check it out for yourself. It comes in different colors. came with this card. Mine is in the uh, 1B. This is the card that it came with. And the wig goes to a little bit over my breasts. So I ordered this wig. Um, I've had it now for about two or three weeks that I've been wearing it. Um, and the wig comes with uh, two combs in the front and one comb in the back. And it has the adjustable straps. Like I said before, it is synthetic. I have experienced a little bit of shedding, which is normal, and uh, definitely, definitely some tangling at the nape of the neck back here. So what I do in order to get rid of the tangling is I spray a little water on the wig even before I wear it. I'll spray a little water on the wig and just kind of brush it out. Not too hard because I want the uh, curl pattern to stay. Um, I haven't washed it yet. But I do just spray a little bit of water on it to just keep it from looking so dry and add a little bit of moisture. I don't put any type of hair products on it because since it's synthetic, I feel like that's just a waste of hair product. It's not going to really absorb the product. So I just will spray a little water on it. And then um, when I put it on, a, uh, I corn roll my hair back. I have on a cap, a wig cap, and I like to use a lighter cap that's like the color of my scalp. So because the wig isn't super thick, you know, if the wind is blowing or just when I'm making my part, it looks a little bit more better with that uh, lighter uh, wig cap on. And then I also, when I apply the wig, I didn't pluck it here or make that part wider, but I did add some um, of the LA Girl Concealer to just make the part more defined. And then when I put on my f actual foundation that I wear on my face, I put rub a little bit more again over my forehead. I did put a little bit of my baby hair out but I didn't pull a ton out because of the way the wig is part and made. I didn't feel like I really needed that but if you feel like you want to do that, if you feel like that makes the wig look a little bit more authentic then you you know obviously go ahead and go for it and do that. I did wear this uh, wig to work and I put it in a ponytail, a low ponytail like so and pulled it back and it was uh, fine. I was able to do that. I wasn't able to do too many other styles and you probably could do more styles but you just have, would be, have to be careful because of the part here is not really um, interchangeable. So for the price, um, I love this wig. I think it's a great investment for $27.99. Um, it's lasted me for a few weeks. I even have done a photo shoot with it and like I said, I've worn it to work experience just a tiny bit of uh, shedding but for the most part I think it's a pretty good wig model model so once again I will put um, the comments down below where you can go ahead and purchase this wig if you are interested so as always want to say thank you so much for watching hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and like I do with all my wigs when I'm not wearing them I place them inside of our wonderful silky sack to keep it protected and give it a little bit more life. If you're not sure what a silky sack is, I will put our website down below where you can go in and check it out and see for yourself. As always, I want to say thank you so much for watching. Turn on your notifications if you haven't already. And remember, better care is better wear.